Hi, I'm Stephen Simon, co-founder of the Spiritual Cinema Circle, with a look at the films for Volume 7, July, in the Circle. Our feature this month is The Park Bench, and here is the theatrical trailer. Emily, hello there. It's a nice place to study. Oh, uh, I'm tutoring. I I'm a tutor. American Lit. I I'm just waiting for him. My, my tutory. Good for you. Mateo? Emily. That's me. You didn't read the Jurita essay I suggested. Structuralism, post structuralism, modernism, post modernism. I'm gonna shoot myself. No, play Mateo! Don't, well, don't do that! <laughs> What's happening? I used to love going to my grandmother's house. This is like this old Victorian, so different than my house. Her house was filled with nooks and crannies and just loaded with stuff. One day, a gentleman arrives at the mansion. He loved Beatrice since the first time he saw her. And to prove his love, he vowed to fight any man who wants to marry her. You getting married? In June. Oh, congratulations. Thank you. Words are saying, I finished reading this book, but your eyes are saying, love me. You don't know what you're talking about. You can't deny something is happening. Don't do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to be on that bench at two, OK? No! Stone is about the first female stonemason in all of Canada. Reminds me a little of the last brickmaker in America that we had many years ago with Sidney Poitier. A woman who marches to her own drum, who takes stone and sculpts it into beautiful, beautiful things, who has an extraordinary philosophy of life, which she says is, I chose the back roads. You, sometimes you get lost in the bushes, but you never know what you're gonna find in the bushes. A very inspirational, true life story about a real artist. Heart to Heart is a magical, uplifting film about two people. A young woman who's born with a very rare heart condition, which should make her very timid, but has the exact opposite. And a young man with a very different condition, and how they meet over Chunky Love ice cream. Seeing Red is a magical, poignant film about healing. All of us have issues from our past, ghosts that sometimes chase us, sometimes meet us in our dreams, sometimes are with us in our daily life. Losing a father is tough. How do we rid ourselves of that baggage? How do we put those ashes away how do we make a stand in our lives so that we can move forward without all of those things from our past? This very powerful film shows us exactly how to do that. So those are the movies for July in the Spiritual Cinema Circle. We hope you enjoy them, and we'll see you in August.